So I was born with a birth defect, and so my legs were webbed at the knee, and so I was unable to straighten my legs out and walk. I consider my legs when I was born my chains, and uh, and so when I was five, they cut my legs off. In that sense, they cut my chains off, and uh, from there I was able to 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 be free. My name is Rudy Garcia Tolson. I'm from Bloomington, California and I'm a Paralympic swimmer. Growing up, I was the youngest out of uh, four kids. Uh, I grew up in a trailer park, uh, and my dad was a, was a cook at a truck stop, and my mom basically took care of uh, us kids at home. My, my first sport I got into was, was swimming. Uh, I had no idea how to swim, and, and finally I got enrolled in some swimming lessons, and they taught me how to swim from the ground up. And from there, uh, I joined an able-bodied swim team. And from that able body swim team, uh, I used to come at dead last in every swim meet I went to. I got, I got really annoyed, I got really frustrated because I knew that I could beat these kids and it didn't have to do anything with my legs. And so at that point, I set my first goal and that goal was to, to beat a kid with legs. My proudest moment uh, so far in life is, is definitely uh, winning a gold medal in, in 2004 at the Paralympic Games in Athens. You know, it's been, been my goal since I was eight years old and here I was eight years later on the world stage. I believe I get my confidence from everyone doubting me. When enough people doubt you and you prove them wrong enough times, you start to feel confident. From a young age, ever since I got my legs amputated to going to elementary school, to middle school, to high school, I've always had kids and people telling me that I couldn't do things. And, and for me, that's what motivates me. That's what fuels me. That's what makes me want to go out and prove them wrong. Uh, I believe proving people wrong is one of the best joys in life. I'm not the type of person who can sit down at a desk and, and not feel the urge to get up and go do something. I love being outdoors. I love uh, sports. I love the competition. I can never, ever imagine myself doing anything besides sports at this point in my life.